All right, Lucas. Hey, how are you? That's your English name, Lucas? Uh, yeah, it's my English name. My Chinese name okay. is Lukai. Lukai, yeah, yeah Lukai. Yeah. Or, yeah, Lukai, but Americans call you Kai Lu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so it's confusing, yeah. right? Yeah, it's confusing, of course. <laughs> all right, uh, Lucas, um, let's start right away. You know, you're in the Czech Republic of all yeah. places. I know that your wife is Czech and yeah. you're there. You moved there maybe about three or four months ago. How long have you been there? Uh, I have been to here for six months. Okay, Almost six, six months. months. Yeah. Okay, six months. How has uh life been in in the Czech Republic for you? It's a new country, right? For you? Yeah, it's a new country. Um, I think the country is a uh, it's a beautiful country, and uh, everybody is nice to me, and the uh, Czech people uh, help me a lot, and uh, they uh, give me the training, and so I don't need to pay it, and uh, the beautiful view, but the traffic is so bad here. <laughs> <laughs> traffic is bad everywhere, right? Like yeah. every country, traffic is bad. You were you were in Shanghai before that, right? Yeah, yeah, I was in the Shanghai and the UFC economy. Yeah, yeah, and and mm -hmm. and traffic is pretty bad in Shanghai, yeah. right? It's not yeah, yeah. the best. So it's it's, it's, it's bad. It's bad. Yeah. <laughs> um. Let's talk about the uh, the PI, right? The the UFC academy. You were there with you know a bunch of solid prospects a lot of good fighters and then you had all the the technology and the coaches yeah. and and what did that do for you you know how did you how did that change you as a fighter spending all that time at the pi mm, the pi because they have they got everything uh, they have the uh, system and uh, every coach has the uh their job it's like a nutritionist can you hear me yeah yeah i, I can uh, hear you so uh, they have a uh, nutritionist, the head coach, the uh, uh, recovery. They have everything there, and we just need to uh, training there, and uh, they help us for everything, and uh, they give us the fight, um, half a year, two fights, so like uh, one year, four fights. But you know the uh, virus is coming, so it's a very hard time. Yeah, how was that? You know, you're probably there, right? When when the coronavirus pandemic started, and uh, how did yeah, that affect uh, everything? The virus coming, uh, it, it stopped. So the gym closed, the PI closed for almost one year. So I went to the Thailand the training and uh, almost two or three months and I come back to Shanghai and I train in Shanghai. I find some uh, a gym. I go there, I train with the different people because the PI is closed. So until the one, uh, after one year, the gym opened again. Yeah, you went to Thailand. I think everybody, all the fighters from the PI went to Thailand because I remember seeing pictures of all the fighters at like Tiger Muay Thai and, and all the other gyms. How was your your time training there in Thailand? Um, Thai tr training, um, I was there uh, because I uh, I'm a wrestler. So I was uh, when I was there, I found a, a boxing coach. Uh, he's uh, uh, preparing for the Peter Yan. He's a Peter Yan's um, John boy. Coach. Yeah, 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 John boy. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. He's uh he's a good coach because he mm -hmm. uh, he uh, taught me how to use my body how to make my punch stronger uh yeah everything's good there so i mm -hmm. i was there just for my striking uh only for striking and uh do some sparring with the different people but, you know um uh, if you train with uh, different place with different people it's it's more close uh, like a fight mm -hmm. And and Tiger Muay Thai, yeah, so many people, right? So, so many fighters. Many people. <laughs> <laughs> crazy. Yeah, it's crazy because when you, when you do the sparring and the, everybody next to you. <laughs> yeah, and and did you get to work on your your Muay Thai also in Thailand? Mm, not too much. I only mm -hmm. doing the boxing in the uh, in the Thailand. Mm -hmm. You like you like boxing more. You you like throwing the hands. 
Yeah, yeah, a little bit more. <laughs> <laughs> but so, you know, and something is, uh, it's, uh, it's funny because I, I train boxing every day for uh, like uh, two or three years, but my kicker is better. <laughs> <laughs> so after you trained in Thailand, you went back to Shanghai. The PI is closed, so you had to find the gym. Was it tough for you? Was it a tough time? I think it's uh, it's not tough for me because I I live in Shanghai for almost twenty years. So mm. I have a friend there, and I was in the Shanghai team uh, because I was in the Shanghai judo team, and uh, we have uh, like uh, people is training the sanda, uh, wrestling, we have uh, uh, boxing, we have mm. everything in the uh, Shanghai University uh, University of Sports. So when I come back to uh, come back to Shanghai, I just uh, send uh, some message to my friend, uh, tell them uh, I want to I want to train with you. Can you um, share your time with me? And they say, oh, okay. I just join them. So it's not difficult for me in Shanghai. When did they open the PI again? When when was that? Oh, I don't remember it. Uh, like. Uh, Summer, last of summer, I think. Oh, last of mm-hmm. summer, yeah, last of summer. Okay. And that's when uh, you were there with uh, Luke Kai Wen. Uh, yeah, yeah. Lee Kai Wen and and all of them. How was tra- how was it training with him? He's a he's a monster, man. He's a he's a beast. Yeah, he's good, but his uh, uh, his weight is uh, uh, how do you say? He fights to sixty one. I fight yeah. six six, and mm-hmm. so my weight is bigger than him. So we don't have uh, too much training together. Because normally, uh, normally my training is uh, uh normally I was uh, eighty uh, if uh, at the uh, not far the time. So oh, okay, so you're pretty big. Yeah, he's too small. <laughs> <laughs> Who did you usually train with at the PI at the academy? It's like uh, like uh, Arthur Chilen, you know, mm, yeah. the Mongolia Keller, the yeah. his fight at UFC now, mm. and. Uh, uh like uh Chui Liu Cai. uh yeah yeah Ramona but he's a good fighter yeah. very, very tough guy uh, Ramona she was part of the the first academy uh like uh the first academy crew that that uh that was training over there at the PI she just made her UFC debut did you see that yeah yeah I saw it I saw it yeah, yeah. I just she's, watched uh, it last summer uh, last Sunday yeah she's she's uh you know, she came a long way, right? Like she was at the PI, and then she was in Thailand, and she went to Las Vegas, and and now she's in the UFC. It's it's cool to see, right? Like it's yeah, it yeah. shows you that you can do it. Everybody can do it from the PI. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, he was in PI, but he's uh he doesn't have a train training partner because his weight uh mm-hmm. is bigger than the girls. Yeah, yeah. She's yeah. she's much bigger than all the other girls. Yeah, yeah. Um, so when you went to the Czech Republic, what gym did you start to train with? Uh, sorry, what gym did you tra- start to oh. train with at the Czech Republic? Uh, I trained in the now I train the three gyms, but the, my um on behalf of uh, a gym, uh, the main is RPG is in the mm-hmm. Prague. Um, they they help me a lot. Uh, yeah, they help me a lot. They give me the free training, and uh, they and they want they help me a lot, and uh, they want they want me to train there every day. But uh, uh, I have a uh, I have my own training plan. So I I go to a uh, other gym for the striking, it's a experimental gym for the striking, and uh, another BGG gym once once a week. Mm-hmm. So you have a good good set of gyms for you to train. Yeah. 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 Now, uh, you have a fight coming up on March 12th, RFA. Who, who's the opponent? Do you know the opponent yet? Yeah, I know. Uh, the opponent is from Poland. Yeah, he's mm. from Poland. And okay. what, can, a stri- what can you tell striker. us? What? Oh, he's a striker. He's a yeah, striker. Yeah, he's a striker, yeah. Okay. Anything else you can tell us about him? Uh, he's a striker, and uh, he also lost the, the last fight and uh, won the four fights. So his four fights win and one fight lost. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, I think because I didn't find the more video in the YouTube. Uh, yeah, okay. his video. Okay. Just so uh, is, 
So um, is this their first time going to Slovakia? Uh, actually, no, because my yeah. family, uh, because my wife is from uh, Czech, Czech Republic and uh, Slovakia. So oh, yeah. in the Christmas, we go to the uh, Slovakia to meet the family. So mm-hmm. I think this time is my second time. Okay. So how, how is Slovakia? You know, I've never been there. So what does it look like? I, I don't I don't know it too much because I just uh, stay with the family. Uh, mm-hmm. Normally just in the check. Okay. But at this okay. time I, I will uh, maybe I will see. <laughs> okay. Um, I, I was looking at your last fight and I watched your last fight at uh, I am Fighter Three, the, yeah. the main event against uh, uh, what is it? What's his name? Com 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 Day Com on Day. Um, I I I can I can read it. <laughs> Okay. So um so that fight, you know, I watched that fight. It was a tough fight, you know. He was he was strong, you know, he could he, he you know, he was pretty good all-around fighter. What did you think about the the matchup and how you performed? Mm, I think my opponent he, he did it well uh because he has uh more fights, MMA fights. He has uh older than me. He has more experience. But I think this this fight it's uh it's not about uh, my level. It's about my experience because I I think I'm stronger and faster, but uh, I am so wanted to finish uh, finish him, so I made some mistake. When I take take him down, I have uh, uh, more confident to finish him. So I'm so hurry. I want to uh, get a mount. So I want to uh, finish him and give him give him the chance to. Uh, get up. Mm-hmm. So, mm, I think it's all. I think he did it well. He has experience. So you learned a lot from that fight. Yeah, I learned a lot from that fight. And uh, you know, the writers tell me I didn't have a fight for one year. Mm-hmm. I think just I need a, this year. I, f- I hope I have more fights to get used to. You. Yeah, you need to be more active to to practice your skills, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because the training so, and the training and the fights totally different. Yeah, totally different. Yeah. Um, so in this fight coming up on March twelfth, what do you want to show the fans? What do you want to show the promotion? Mm, I think at um, I think first of all, um, I'm a fighter. I don't I don't want to think uh, what what I should show to the people. I just mm-hmm. want to win the fight, whatever. By decision, by KO, by submission, whatever. I just want want to win the uh, win the fight. This is the this is the first thing, mm-hmm. and uh, after that, maybe the KO or something. Yeah. Okay. Just, so, so the goal is to win, no matter yeah, what. Yeah. Goal is to yeah. Win and that's it. <coughs> yeah. Excuse me. <coughs> um, Lucas, thank you. You know, it's uh, good catching up with you and. Uh, Good luck on the fight and, and the rest of the camp. And hopefully, uh, you know, we'll be talking soon again. Thank you. Thank you.